Just got the fire going. I'm gonna put the canteen cup on, heat up some water. And we're gonna make some Starbucks Via coffee. It's a campsite. Hey guys. Anthony here, it's about 9 o'clock at night. I got the uh, camper all set up. Try to give you guys a view. I got my keys and everything here on the floor. Some water. Some stuff on the back uh, back seat, pillow, and my sleeping pad. Let's see the weather radio on. But, uh, I'm good to go tonight. Seven. Had a pretty good night's sleep. It's um, probably got down into the upper 40s last night. Uh, I was pretty warm in my uh, military sleeping system. No problems there. Good night's sleep. And now I'm getting ready to brush my teeth and make breakfast. This is a really good gluten cereal. Um, I'll give you the name of it in the description box. But I eat it every morning with a, just a little bit of honey and a little bit of um, coconut milk. It's excellent, filling, nutritious, better than uh, oatmeal, things like that. Uh, really gets you a kickstart. So we're cooking a, like a batch up right now. Uh, have with our coffee. Alright guys, I wanted to show you this light my fire kit. It comes with, uh, I ate out of the bowl, I had my cereal in the bowl. It's got a little, another piece that acts as a lid that is, uh, can be a dish. And then it's got this little cutting board or strainer uh, on it. And I've got a review on my site with this. This is a great little piece of kit to have. I got my Mora knife. That's great for camp chores like this. And this is the Mora. I think this is the number two. Uh, just a great all-around knife. And uh, I brought myself a piece of uh, Italian salami. So I'm going to attempt to cut up a couple pieces right now on the cutting board. And uh, have me some nice salami. Uh, this morning. This Mora knife just you can get almost any camp chore you got done, you need done. Let's go three, four, let's go for an even five. See that guys? You know, a piece of salami you could add to some eggs. I may do that later, but I just felt like having a little snack, some little protein, and this fits the bill. So there you have it. Now for the taste. All right, I want to show you guys how I slept last night. Um, one of the things I need to do is buy a pair of blinds for these windows, um, like a mini blind or like a Z shade, something like that, because at night, um, you know, people could see in. So what I did last night was I made myself 
uh, one of the things you have to do in the field is improvise. So I cut a garbage bag in half and I taped it up over the windows. And therefore I uh, made myself a kind of a, I guess you could call it a redneck shade, a makeshift shade. But anyway, I had my laptop in here and I was watching, um, I didn't get a chance to watch Duck Dynasty, I watched some Dual Survivor episodes. Um, I've got, had my phones charging, I have my radio, weather radio right there handy on the top shelf. Um, this little motion light comes in very handy uh, because it turns on when you, you know, get up to get out to go to the bathroom or whatever and you can see what you're doing. Um, my sleeping system was the US GI sleeping system with a Thermarest Trail Pro regular pad. I had two pillows, which I was fine. Uh, my clothing, I just switched uh, to my sweatpants, took off my uh, regular pants, and I put on that little flannel hooded uh, shirt to sleep in. I had an extra sheet right there, and then my um, sleeping bag uh, holder, my hat. I got my walking stick along the side here, my jar of water. And then I just put my keys, my, my Leatherman, my Becker Necker neck knife, uh, my little uh, Stream Life flashlight. And then right next to me, I keep the little Apollo, Black Diamond Apollo Lantern, which um, works fine when you got to get up or keep a light on dim. Again, I had this, uh, I laid out this really nice rubber exercise mat on the other side. So when I come in and out of the camper, to get things I'm not constantly dirtying the carpet and then I have these little um, little rubberized mats that I showed in another video but uh, I was pretty toasty last night didn't have to use the AC um, it did get into the 40s I believe and so um, my sleep system kept me perfect I was not cold um, that is the uh, sleep system with the green bag inside. Let's see if I can show you. There's lots of reviews on YouTube on this bag, but it's got the uh, green bag you button in to the outer liner, which is like a Gore-Tex liner. That's the camo color one. And then the green bag buttons in. Uh, these bags probably have the best zippers on them you'll ever find on a bag. Uh, they don't snag. They work all the time. And again, I just zipped up the uh, both of them and uh, snuggled up, and I was fine. This Trail Pro regular is fine, no problems. Got up a couple times uh, during the night to go to the bathroom, uh, and that was it. Other than that, uh, kept the roof vent open right there, just like that. And I had this window open about halfway, and then I shut it during the night when I got uh, a little uh, cold. But um, so that was the the nice thing about this. The door locks. It's got a little deadbolt lock, you know, so you kind of secure at night. And uh, that's it.